In 2025, businesses have more power than ever to build their own internal tools. Whether it's with no code, AI assisted coding, or traditional engineering, you can now create software that fits your workflow without setting link for bloated tools or generic platforms. These internal tools, sometimes called dark apps, aren't built for public users or app stores. They are designed to solve real problems inside your business. In this video, I'll break down the full process of building custom internal tools from idea to execution and help you choose the right approach for your team. Let's dive into it. Step one, define the problem and the scope. Every great internal tool starts with one thing, a real business need. Look for bottlenecks, manual data entry, repetitive steps that slow your team down. Then define the scope of your app, what it should do, who will use it. An app for frontline employees needs to be fast and focused, for example. For leadership, you might build dashboards or admin panels. And for clients, it might need a Polish portal with secure access. Step two, map your data sources. Next, figure out where your data lives. Many processes still run out of spreadsheets or disconnected tools. Your internal app can become the connected tissue that centralizes that data, whether your data lives in SQL databases, Google Sheets, paper forms, or SaaS tools, you will want a clear plan for how your app connects, syncs, and migrates that info. Some platforms support native integrations, others use APIs, imports, or even OCR for physical docs. Step three, choose a development method. In 2025, there are three main ways to build internal tools, each with its own pros and cons. Option one, traditional coding. With a development team, you will get full control, every feature, every line of logic. This is ideal for highly specialized tools, complex systems, or apps with strict security needs. But it comes at a cost, more time, more money, and ongoing maintenance. This is best for SaaS products, public apps, or highly regulated industries. Option two, no-code platforms. No-code lets you build software visually with drag and drop tools, configuration panels, and built-in logic. You can build powerful apps in days, not months. Apps that connect to spreadsheets, dashboards, internal data, and even AI. Platforms like Glide are purpose-built for internal tools connecting seamlessly to Google Sheets, SQL, Airtable, and other sources. You can build portals, dashboards, inspection tools, and more without writing a single line of code. No code is perfect in this case for teams that want speed, flexibility, and autonomy. Option three, AI-assisted vibe coding. The newest approach is working side-by-side -side with AI. You describe what you want in plain language and AI helps you build it. This method allows for rapid prototyping with high visual freedom. You can decide quickly, test features, and refine through prompts. But be careful. AI-generated code can be buggy, insecure, or hard to scale. This method works best for quick MVPs, microsites, or silo tools without sensitive data. Use it for ideas, not infrastructure. Step four, decide who will build it. Once you have chosen your approach, it's time to assign the work. Internal developers are great if you have technical stuff or want to empower no dev teams using no code. External agencies or freelancers can speed up the process and bring experience, especially if you are new into no code or AI tools. Platforms like Glide have partner ecosystems that you can tap into for help, for example. Step five, launch, iterate, and scale. Once the tool is built, launch it to your team and listen closely. Tweak the layout, add missing features, and improve performance. As adoption grows, your internal app can evolve into a scalable system, integrating with other tools, tightening security, and serving more users. And when one tool works, more will follow. Most teams don't stop at one app, they'll build an entire ecosystem. So, in 2025, there is no excuse to stay stuck with bad tools. You can build what you need, how you need it, faster than ever. Whether you go with no code, AI, or traditional code, the end goal is the same. Tools that match your business, your team, and your data.
start small, solve one problem, and then build again. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, subscribe for more tech breakdowns and no code insights. And check out Glide to start building your own internal tools today. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.